So we have some rapid fire questions for you. Uh, we're going to ask them super fast. And so, what's the first thing that you do when you wake up in the morning? Uh, go to the restroom. <laughs> okay. And the last thing before you go to sleep? Uh, seems like it's also going to the restroom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, while storyboarding, do you drink and draw or you draw and drink? I draw, I don't really drink. Okay, and what's the most important animation principle? The, what's the most important animation principle? Uh, know exactly what you're doing. Great. So, if you, if you could trade places with any other person for a, uh, for a week, for, for a week, famous or non-famous, who would that be? For one week? Yeah. Obama. <laughs> Only one week though. Okay, uh, and if you could be any character in fiction, whom would that be? If I can be any character in fiction, fiction. yeah. Uh, I would like to be Superman. Superman, awesome. <laughs> uh, so, do, do, during your childhood, which was your famous, uh, the favorite char uh, cartoon character? During my childhood, um, Pinocchio. Nice. So, one question that you find yourself asking co-artists? <laughs> I, um, do you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> I say that a lot. Okay, uh, any animation nightmare that you have had? Animation nightmare? You mean like a real dream or nightmare? A not like a nightmare. Anything, uh, while working or however, or, or even in your dreams? Uh, animation nightmare would be, I, f I finished animating and then I accidentally de delete all my data. That's bad. That, did, did that really, really happen? Bad. It did happen one time that I lost a day of work. Yeah, oh it was God. painful. That's bad. Yeah. So speak something in Hindi for us. Oh really? Mira Ram Raman Hoi Hai Doza Parada That's not Hindi. Yeah. That's not Hindi? <laughs> uh, Bengali <laughs> Kiki <laughs> Daba. Uh, what else in Hindi? Um, oh yes, uh, Namaste and also uh, Film Malinge. Any sport that you play? Uh, I play badminton. Great. And, and, and you guys have a lot of great in, uh, badminton players in uh, India, like Prasanjeev. Uh, that's Prasanjeev over there. Awesome. Yay. <laughs> Uh, so to unwind, uh, what would you pick? Hancock, or Bangkok, or Shalikok? Bangkok. Bangkok. Awesome. So that was the rapid fire round for Raman. And let's just ask him general questions with uh, which a lot of our viewers I'm sure are going to benefit. So where do you draw your inspiration from when you're uh, working on your projects? I draw my inspiration from talking to people, from talking to the animators, mm -hmm. sometimes we bounce ideas and sometimes I watch them mm -hmm. and then uh, that gave that would give me ideas mm -hmm. um, sometimes I get ideas when I uh, when I wake up in the morning before I totally awake I stay in bed and kind of like come up with silly ideas yeah that's great. so for animators and story artists who are starting in this field like freshers what would be your advice to them I think the thing is just keep doing it um, because you only get better if you keep doing it. If you if you did some animation and then you think, oh hey, I did a great job, I don't have to do it. Uh, I'll I'll just wait till the next time and I'll do it again and I should be fine. Um, then you will see other people who work a lot and who really try to get better at what they're doing. They would be they would become better than you because. Um, Animation, in a way, is it's a kind of a competitive industry. People just can't keep getting back better, so you have to keep working hard to uh, stay stay on the game. So, any particular points on building a, a demo reel for animation, like that our viewers would benefit? Um, I think the main thing is like if I'm if I'm looking for an animator, the the main thing I'm looking for is the the way to act. Like someone use a character to show emotions. Uh, in a convincing and uh, con connecting way. Like when you watch the animation, you would believe that this is real. Uh, another thing I would look for is a good animation that with good, uh, that with good physical weight and 
uh, natural way of walking or talking or even um, just being natural, I think it's very important. Right. So being a story artist, uh, do you find time to work on your personal stories or like like a short film or comics or anything like that? Um, right now it's really hard for me to work on a short film. I used to do that at PDI when, when before we were doing feature because when we were doing uh, animated features, it's, it's, it's usually it's a three to four years period of time that you're constantly working on getting this getting this movie done mm -hmm. um, and then after you finish a movie you take a little break and then you start on a new one so but I do try to work on little ideas here and there um, just to keep my brain or the creative aspect of um, um, more active um, I mean, hopefully, one one of the day. I mean, in the future, that I can bring one of these ideas into a short film, mm -hmm. or even an idea for uh, for a bigger story. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's not a constant thing that I do. I, I mean, I don't. I'm not working on a short film right now. I, um, I'm uh, lacking the energy to do that. Yeah. Okay. So thank you, Raman, for answering all these questions. Uh, I'm sure a lot of our viewers are going to benefit from this. Thank uh, you. And just introducing the team again, uh, that's Amrit Dergavan, Sumit Verma, and Prashant Kavale, Andy Maxman, and that's Prasanjeev Nag. We thank him a lot for being our cameraman Thanks. for today. Thanks thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Phil Malenge. Any signing off words? Uh, uh, what? Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. Chinese. <laughs>